guys welcome back to our channel chandra awesome again uh, in this today's tutorial we will learn about how to use the mate connector inside the parse tool as you are already aware about how to use the main connector in the assembly itself but but you know you can also use the mate connector inside the uh, part studio but uh, this mate connector is generally used for uh, combining the parts itself only uh, in, in assembly uh, what is the difference is between these two guys is there is nothing any differences how does, does the mate connector works inside the assembly as the same like here also it works but it gives the like a clarification for you when you working with the assemblies if you perform mate connector right itself in the past studio as for example i just created here uh, some hello cube right itself uh, I create this just using the extrude tool. Let me show you what I created this just by using the uh, thin extrude, which uh, was all updated by the concept software just last week. Even I also updated a video how to use thin extrude in our CAD software in our channel. Uh, Okay, I'm going to demonstrate here how to work with thin extrude just side the sketch and extrude it here just like same you can perform the direction operations you can go through the checkout video and just making some part right here just for me to explain how to work with my connector uh, here you can see at the top toolbar made connector click on it you can see the pop-up window just like how does it works exactly uh, exactly in the assembly itself okay uh, you can see uh, I'm going to when I'm placing the mouse at the part you can see it's showing the points where the mate connector should be possible to make uh, just like you can also give at any point you want just like I will where I want at this corner the mate connector will form itself and it asking the owner part actually it will defaultly asking selecting the own, this part only because here uh, only one part is available that's very showing for in this part studio you have to give the owner part of the uh, uh, main character but in assembly you don't need to give owner part because it defaultly taken by the computer itself so i just need to sell the owner part then only it will show the points and here you can also see the real and mine real and mine means nothing but uh, if you want to change this main position to any other you can also change uh, this uh, is actually works when uh, you already give the weight character itself. I already explained you in the video. I will also give in that video itself uh, in the description. You can also go through that. Okay, that is the real line, and you can also move this weight character as any position you want at any angle. You can rotate. See. And you can also perform the solutions, change the direction of rotation, just like same how to work with the SMB. So that's all about this topic, guys. So I know this is a small topic, but it is really you know, many of some of the cat designers who come from other cats to own shape they are not aware of that and also much confusing about how to work with this uh, assembly section that's why i made this video i hope they will understand how to work with the uh, assembly and uh, pass studio easily from the walls thank you guys have a nice day and and one thing guys uh, as 
you can all i already mentioned the, about the my model which was uh, designed by me and was i i already shared about this in the social media and also uh, i'm going to upload that video soon in tomorrow or maybe day after tomorrow i hope you might like that uh, i already uploaded video if you not watch this go watch it guys i hope you might definitely like that thank you guys have a nice day